all right so csi net exams are over and i'm getting two queries very uh, you know very frequently especially from those who have felt that they have not done well or their performance is not satisfactory according to them from uh, for this particular csi net exam so this these are the queries of them and i hope if you are uh, resonating with the topic which i have given in the thumbnail you must be here to watch that so uh, both the topics or both these queries i'm going to take in a single video and uh, these are just my opinion these are just my advices so please uh, take or please do consider them like that itself the first question is that uh, should i start my preparation just now because this time i was not able to do well or the paper was tough i am not satisfied with uh, with my uh, with my performance so should i start uh, preparing for the next exam now or how should i prepare for the exam so that's one thing and the second thing is that whether the exam will uh, be conducted in december exam or in the month of december or not whether the next csi net exam is going to be in december or or to be precise when the next csi net exam is going to be so both these things we are going to look upon so one by one we'll talk about it first thing is that should you start your preparation or how should you basically prepare for the next exam see first thing i'll tell you that please don't be harsh on yourself right now because you have just given exam i know lot of emotions will be there lot of uh, you know lot of thinking lot of things must be going on in your mind that you have studied for so long for this exam and somehow because of some mistakes or something happened and you were not satisfied with what you whatever you did this time but uh, now you want again to prepare for the next time and you are thinking that how to do that okay or what should i change or what what exactly i should do or should i start studying from today itself see uh, just consider two three things first thing is that uh, you have just given exam your mind is right now in a situation where it has done or you might have given your extra effort for this preparation right and that's why your mind must not be in a relaxing mode so like you don't have to overburden yourself don't be harsh on yourself you have to give some time for yourself to relax down okay you have to relax a little bit so i will suggest to take a break at least for one week don't uh, you know study as such like don't study thoroughly and one more thing that for this exam any exam like csr net gate or any exam whatever exam is there these exams are not like sprint race like how fast you start or how early you start or how effectively you start it's everything is about how you finish or how consistently you go through it so that consistency plays very important role over here so instead of starting early i will suggest to start take a break give yourself a little bit of time and then start your preparation but when you start your preparation be consistent with that okay that is one thing second thing is that once the response sheet comes now after that only you can decide that how exactly you have to prepare or how exactly you should uh, start your preparation for the next exam what mistakes you did this time what are the things which you have to avoid for the next one uh, you know all these things all these questions will be answered yourself uh, by the response sheet so let the response sheet uh, response sheet answer key comes uh, let that come and let's see where you are making mistakes and after that i will make this video again in detail okay that what are the things which you can do fine and i'll also analyze the question paper because i have found something very interesting in the previous few csr net exam and that video will be dropping very soon so that will be about that what exactly csir is doing and how you have to basically cope up with the competition around you okay then the next question is that when exactly this csr net exam is going to be the next csr net exam whether it will be in december or uh, when it is going to be exactly so uh, the thing is ki uh, there is nothing official about it first of all it's all from my opinion uh, whatever i have seen in the past 4 5 years with csir with ugc uh, with nta so all those things i am compiling to make this uh, like this assumption first thing is that csir net exam has just happened in the month of september and uh, like in order to give response sheet in order to give then the correction window will be there then you will get answer keys and then uh, there will be like first response sheet will come then answer key will come then correction window will come where you can uh, like go for the challenge challenging a particular question and then the result will come so all these things will take somewhere around uh, one and a half month like at max or it can be done in one month but looking at csir i don't think they will be able to do it it will take around one and a half to two month so if it is september it will take around october or mid of november so till mid of november i guess the result will be there if csir is very fast or the nt and csir they are working very effectively and very fastly in that case you might get the result as early as 
uh, October last week. Okay, that will be the final or that will be the quickest way how they are going to give. But uh, if they are going to be in a usual manner, then it will go till November mid or November like yeah, it will touch November or November mid. So if this exam they are going to get rid of this particular CSIR June 2022 exam by the end of November so we cannot expect that they will just announce for the next exam because see there are a lot of procedures which goes on when a new exam is conducted there are like new question papers which they have to set up then uh, they have to take it like you have, they have to give application form at least one month they have to give for form filling procedure then admit card releases then center changes so many things happen you have just seen right so all those things will again going to take around two months at least two months so after november you cannot expect if the exam if they are going to give this result for this csi june 2022 exam if you are going to get this result in the month of november or in the month of early november then also you cannot expect exam to be in the month of december in december and you can expect if the result of this csi june 2022 comes somehow if they are working you know like miraculously good and they give the result in the month of mid october so if you get the result everything result uh, you know uh, the final result everything is done by the mid of october in that case you can expect okay in the last of december or in the last week of december we can accept, expect exam but as of now with the current scenario i cannot assure that and and my gut feeling says that the exam the next csi net exam will be as early as in the month of january and if it uh, goes with the usual manner in the usual pattern in that case they are going to conduct the next exam in the month of uh, february so yeah that's what i wanted to discuss here because so many of you were asking because you want to you know uh, plan your preparation and all the things about it so that's why i made this video and that's it for this there are so many things which i want to discuss with you regarding the csi net exam but i'm just waiting for the response sheet to come so once the re response sheet comes we will analyze the question paper we will see how and what type of questions are asked and then we will come to a conclusion that how you have to make your preparation for the upcoming exams all right so do let me know if you want something uh, from like some type of query if, if is there from your side regarding exam regarding preparation do let me know in the comment section below i'll try to make a detailed video on that and for my side for this particular video that's it from my side okay so i'll just wrap up over here Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one till then. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Take care. Hey guys. So I teach live on Unacademy Plus platform. Here I teach for the CSI UGC net category. And you can follow me over here for regular classes. You can access my free classes as well as my paid classes on this particular platform. The classes which are free, you can get that under the section of special classes. Whereas in order to access my paid classes, paid live classes we have to take an academy plus subscription so do make sure that you take the an academy plus subscription to access all my paid classes which are quite organized the whole syllabus is being completed over there and the classes are quite regular over there so make sure that you take an academy plus subscription by using my referral code that is n underscore huda that's it for this thank you so much